Hello friend, now this is the third part of miscellaneous exercise and in this uh, video we will learn solve the equations in by using the method of reduction method. I will explain all the examples in a very simple language. Now uh, let us start. At the same time also me an academic cha platform work Baravi M1 and M2 Shikotai. To me, Nishita's the video baga plus courses and a special classes like the special classes like just free as the and plus that it will answer subscription. Yeah, again, yeah, video introduction, yeah, video and other kai PowerPoint slides like that to me baga and is there some that to my like that's a subscription. How I say that to me, massa promo code of the shot I was sent to someone that to my like that's my discount more shaken. तथे ते मी देखील 12 वी लाइव क्लासेस घेत आहे ते तुम्हाला आवडलं तर निश्चितच तुम्ही ते त्याचा सबस्क्रिप्शन घेऊ शकता अन अकॅडमी प्लस सबस्क्रिप्शन एमएसटी सीईटी 2021 लीडर्स बॅच लर्न फ्रॉम द स्टार वॉर्ड्स ऑफ सप्तर्षी क्लासेस फॉर एमएसटी सीईटी आणि या बॅचेस या 14th of December पसन चालू होता है तुम्हें इती थे एंड्रॉल कोर शुकता है नंतर An Academy Plus Okay That is Are you a plus subscriber चल तुम्हें plus subscriber असा तर तुम्हाला ही सर्व खालचे benefits मिलती रहा मदे आनि सर्व काई तुम्हाला एकाच एचा खाली मेल चेहो That is everything under single plus subscription गेतल तर तुम्हाला त्यानंतर अन अकॅडमी प्लस सबस्क्रिप्शन यामध्ये 12 महिन्याचा आणि 6 महिन्याचे दोन कोर्सेस त्यांनी वेगवेगळे आहेत ते आणि त्यामध्ये शिकवणारे हे सर्व एज्युकेटर्स आहेत यात देखील तुम्ही प्रवेश घेऊ शकता याचाही देखील सबस्क्रिप्शन तुम्ही घेऊ शकता नंतर हे सर्व टॉप एज्युकेटर्स आहेत त्या प्लॅटफॉर्म वरती शिकवणारे तुमच्या सर्व शंकांचे निरसन करतील आणि निश्चितच तुम्हाला बोर्डा चा परिश्य मदे CET मदे चांगली मार्स मिलती या नंतर टेस्ट सेरीज देखी लाइट तैंचा या टेस्ट सेरीज मदे देखील तुम्ही बाग गियो शकता है या टेस्ट कशा दाईचा त्या साथी देखी त्या सा डिस्क्रिप्शन इते दिले लाए तुम्ही भगू शकता है अनी जर समझा तुम निश्चितच डिस्काउंट मिळेल आई विल स्टार्ट द सेकंड क्वेश्चन एक्सप्रेस द फॉलोइंग इक्वेशन इन मैट्रिक्स फॉर्म एंड सॉल्व देम बाय द मेथड ऑफ रिडक्शन द फर्स्ट इक्वेशन दैट इज x y z 1 2x y 1 3x 3y 4z 2 therefore the is now the solution the given equation the given equation equation can be can be written in can be written in the matrix matrix form form as okay so now the given equation can be written in the matrix form here is a the form is now see this here 1 minus 1 1 1 minus 1 1 2 minus 1 0 3 3 minus 4 variable matrix x y z and here is a 
constant matrix that is a 1 1 and 2 okay now by using the uh, reduction method we will solve this now the first operation we will make here that is the upper triangular by r2 minus 2 times r1 and r3 minus 3 times r1 then you will have here 1 minus 1 1 r2 minus 2 times r1 therefore you have here 0 minus 1 minus 1 into minus 2 that will become plus and therefore you will have minus 1 plus 2 here is a 1 0 again minus 2 next is r3 minus 3 times you will have a 0 next is a r3 minus 3 into minus r1 that minus minus will become plus and here is a 6 next is a minus 4 minus 3 minus 4 minus 3 that you will have minus 7 and here is a x y z and that's equals to here's a 1 r2 minus 2 times r1 that is a 2 1 minus 2 that is a minus 1 r3 minus 3 times r3 minus 3 times r1 that is a 2 minus 3 that is nothing but here is a minus 1 okay now the next is what is this operation that is r3 minus 6 times r r2 by the operation r3 minus 6 times r2 therefore we have here 1 minus 1 1 0 1 minus 2 6 times again here is 0 0 minus 7 and minus 2 into minus 6 minus 12 minus 7 and 12 therefore minus 7 and there is a plus 12 5 and here is a variable matrix x y z at the same time on this side what is that 1 minus 1 r3 minus 6 times r2 that minus and minus will become plus minus 1 and plus 6 here we have 5 okay this is a 5 now the matrix multiplication see this here x minus y plus z first two next is a 0 plus y minus 2z and what about the last 0 plus 0 plus 5z and that's equals to 1 minus 1 and 5 1 minus 1 and 5 now we we'll equate this that is by the equality of matrices by equality equality of matrices equality of matrices what is that the first equation is a x minus y plus z x minus y plus z is equals to 1 
as in the first one. What about the second? Y minus 2z. Y minus 2z that is equal to minus 1. And what about the last? That is the 5z is equal to 5. 5z is equal to 5. These are the three equations. First, second, and here is a third equation. Therefore, now 5z is equal to 5, and that's why z is equal to 5 upon 5, and that's equal to 1. Therefore, z is equal to 1. So, let's, therefore, z is equal to 1. Now, put the value of z in equation number 2. Put z is equal to 1 in equation 2 that is a y minus 2 z is equal to minus 1 that is a y minus 2 into 1 that is equal to minus 1 y minus 2 is equal to minus 1 Therefore, y is equal to minus 1 plus 2 and here is a 1. Therefore, y is equal to 1 here. y is equal to 1. Now, put the value of y and z in equation number 1. Put y put is equal to 1 and z is equal to 1 in equation 1. Okay. Put these values in equation number 1. What is the equation? x minus y plus z is equal to 1. x minus y plus z is equal to 1. Therefore, here x minus 1 plus 1 and that is equal to 1. Therefore, x is equal to 1. <coughs> Hence, that is therefore x. Hence, we have x is equal to 1, y is equal to 1, and z is equal to 1. Is the required required solution. This is the required solution. x plus y. Next question. x plus y is equal to 1. z is absent there. y plus z is equal to 5 by 3 and z plus x is equal to 4 upon 3. Now the solution. Okay. The given equation given equation given equation can be written in the matrix form in the matrix form as this is the first is one one and zero next is a zero one and one and what about the last one? That is 1, 0, 1. x, y, z is 
that is equals to 1 5 upon 3 4 upon 3 okay now again by using the in the reduction form what is the first r3 minus by the operation r3 minus r1 we get r3 minus r1 we get 1 1 0 0 1 1 and last is here is a 0 okay r3 minus r1 there is a again minus 1 is here and the last is a 1 okay. the variable matrix is as it is x y z and that's equals to here is also r3 minus r1 r3 minus r1 1 next is a 5 upon 3 r3 4 by 3 minus 1 that is a 1 upon 3 here is a 1 upon 3 okay now the next operation that is r3 plus r2 r3 plus r2 then we will get the upper triangular by the operation by r3 plus r2 we get we get here is the triangle 1 1 0 0 1 1 r3 plus r r3 plus r2 therefore you will have a 0 next here is also 0 and 1 plus 1 that is equals to 2 and last is x y z that is equals to r3 plus r2 1 5 by 3 r3 plus r2 that is a 5 by 3 plus 1 by 3 that is 6 by 3 which is nothing but the there is a 2 okay now this is the upper triangular now we have the solution that is multiplication first row this is and multiplication that is x plus y plus 0 second is 0 plus y plus z 0 plus y plus z and what about the last 0 plus 0 plus 2z and here that is equal to 1 5 upon 3 and last is 2 ok what about the next that is x plus y by the by equality equality of matrices equality of matrices that is x plus y plus 0 that is equals to 1 means what x plus y x plus y that is equals to 1 this is the first equation what about the second y plus z that is equals to 5 upon 3 this is the second equation and the last is 2z is equals to 2 2z is equals to 2 and this is the third equation therefore from this 2z as here is a 2z is equals to 2 therefore z is equals to 1 now put the value of z in equation number 2 
put z is equals to 1 in equation 2. What is that? y plus z y plus z is equals to 5 upon 3. Therefore, y plus 1 that is equals to 5 upon 3 and that is here is a y is equals to 5 upon 3 minus 1 that is equals to 2 upon 3. Therefore, y is equals to 2 upon 3. Here is y is equals to 2 upon 3. Now, the next is put the value of this y is equals to 2 upon 3 in equation number 1. That is equation number 1 is simple that is x plus y that is equals to 1 x plus 2 upon 3 is equals to 1 therefore x is equals to 1 minus 2 upon 3 and that is equals to 1 by 3 x is equals to therefore here x is equals to 1 upon 3. Hence, 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 x is equals to 1 upon 3, y is equals to 2 upon 3, and z is equals to 1, is, is the the required required solution. This is the, the required solution. Okay. Now the next is two x minus y plus z is equals to one. X plus two y plus three z is equals to eight. Three x plus y minus four z is equals to one. Therefore the the given equation given equations equations can be can be written in in written in the matrix form matrix form form x all right here see this equation that is a 2 minus 1 1 1 2 3 3, 1, minus 2. Next is a variable matrix which is the x, y, z and last is constant matrix that is 1, 8 and here is a 1. Okay. Now the first operation that is R12 operator by using the R12 by R12 we get by R12 we get here 1 2 3 2 minus 1 1 and next is a 3 1 and minus 4. Here is a x, y, z matrix x, y, z and last is 1, 8 and by R12 sorry that is 8 and 1 right here 8 and 1 this is now by using the operation, what is that operation? R2 minus 2 times R1 and R3 minus 3 times R1. 
by the operation R2 minus 2 times R1 and R3 minus 3 times R1. Now here the first row is as it is which is the 1, 2 and 3. What about the second? R2 minus 2 times R1. Therefore, here is a 0. Minus 1 minus 2 into 2 that is minus 4 and overall you will have minus 5. Next is a 1, 2 into 3, 6, 1 minus 6 which is the minus 5 and what about the last? Here is a 0, first element, 3 times 1 minus 6 means here we have minus 5, minus 4, okay, minus 4 and here is a 3 times that is 3 into 3 9 minus 4 minus 9 minus 13 bracket complete we will have x y z that is equals to it is as it is first next is r2 minus 2 times r1 that is 1 minus 16 which is the minus 15 1 minus that is a 24 1 minus 24 which is the minus 23 okay this is what about the next that is a r3 minus r2 by the operation r3 minus r2 we get okay now here the first row is as it is which is the 1 2 3 0 minus 5 and minus 5 0 here is a 0 minus 13 and plus 5 minus 13 and plus 5 that is here is a minus 8 and on this side here is a variable x y and z and equal to r3 minus r2 that is a 8 minus 15 r3 is minus 23 minus 23 plus 15 means you will have here minus 8 now we will perform the matrix multiplication what is here the matrix multiplication here is the first row first column that is x plus 2y plus 3z next is a 0 minus 5y minus 5z and last is a 0 plus 0 minus 8z and here that is equals to 8 minus 15 and minus 8 okay now by the equality of matrices we will write here by the equality of by equality of matrices by equality of matrices we have the three equations first is x plus 2y plus 3z that is equals to 8 next is minus 5y minus 5z that is equals to minus 15 and last is minus 8z is equals to minus 8 this is the first and second 
and here we go third equation now we'll solve here that is minus 8z is equals to minus 8z is equals to minus 8 therefore z is equals to 1 put z is equals to 1 in equation number 2 in equation number 2 what is that here minus 5y minus 5z that is equals to minus 50 substitute z is equals to y therefore you have minus 5y minus 5 into 1 that is equals to minus 15 therefore minus 5y minus 5 minus 15 and minus 5y here is a minus 5y is equals to minus 15 plus 5 and that's equals to minus 10 therefore minus 5y is equals to minus 10 and that's why y is equals to 2 now put this y is equals to 2 put y is equals to 2 z is equals to 1 in equation 1 then we get we get what is that equation number 1 equation 1 is x plus 2y plus 3z is equals to 8 x plus 2y plus 3z is equals to 8. Therefore, x 2 into 3 into 1 that is equals to 8. That is equals to 8. Therefore, x is equals to 1, x is equals to 1, hence, hence, x is equals to 1, y is equals to 2, z is equals to 1, is, is the required required solution this is the required solution now the next problem is x plus y plus z is equals to 6 3x minus y plus 3z is equals to 10 5x plus 5y minus 4z is equals to 3 okay now the given equation given equations given equations can be can be written in the matrix form As. okay the these equations one 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 three minus one three five five minus four it is a variable matrix x y z and on this side the constant matrix 6 10 
and here is a 3. Now the first operation that is a R2 minus 3 times R1 and R3 minus 5 times R1. R2 minus 3 times R1. R3 minus 5 times R1. Then we will have here. One, one, one. R three minus three times R one. You will have here zero minus one, and here is a minus three. Minus one, minus three. That will become minus four. Next is R two three minus three. Three minus three. Yeah, that will become here zero. Okay. The next is a R3 minus 5 times R1. Now this element will become here 0 and here is also 0. Next is a R3 minus 4 minus 5 R1 minus 5. That is a minus 5 and minus 4 and minus 5. That will become minus 9. That is a complete. Variable matrix which is the x, y, z. Now on this side, see this here. 6 is as it is. R2 minus 3 times R1, 10 minus 18. 10 minus 18, that is a minus 8. Next is a R3 minus 5 times R1, 3 minus 18. 3 minus 18. That is a minus, that is a R3 minus 5 times R1, that is 5 into 6, 30. That is a 3 minus 30, that is a minus 27. Okay. Now the next is a, that is a multiplication of the matrix. The first is x plus y plus a is equals to 6. What about the next? Minus 4y is equals to minus 8 and the last is minus 9z is equals to minus 27. Now we saw this equation that is a minus 9z is equals to minus 27 minus 9z z is equals to minus 27 therefore z is equals to z is equals to 3 this is the first one what about the second second is minus 4y is equals to minus 8 that is a minus 4y is equals to minus 8 Therefore, y is equals to 2. Therefore, y is equals to 2. And what about the last? That is an x plus y plus z is equals to x plus y plus z is equals to here is a 6. I will substitute the values. The value of y is a x plus 2 and z is a 3 and here is a 6. Therefore, x is equals to 6 minus 5. Therefore, x is equals to 1. y is equals to 2 and z is equals to Three is hence that is a x is equals to one here. Hence x is equals to one, y is equals to two, z is equals to three is 
the, the required required solution. This is the required solution. Now the next problem is x plus 2y plus z is equal to 8. 2x plus 3y minus z is equal to 11. 3x minus y minus 2z is equal to 5. Now the solution. Okay. The given equations. The given equations. equations can be can be written in the matrix form matrix form as now see this here how we can write here the there is a one two one two three minus one three minus one minus two and on this side x y z Eight, eleven, eight, eleven, and five. Two. Therefore, by using this uh, operation, by R two minus two times R one and and. R3 minus 3 times R1. Therefore, here you will get 1, 2, 1. R2 minus 2 times R1, here you will get 0. 3 minus 4, that is a minus 1. Minus 1, minus 2, that is a minus 3. What about here? R3 minus 3 times R1, here is a 0 minus 1 and minus 6 that is a minus 7 minus 2 and here is a 3 overall you will get here is a minus 5 the constant matrix x y that is the variable matrix this is a what about here 8 r2 minus 2 times r1 11 minus 16 11 minus 16, therefore we will get here minus 5. 5 minus 3 times that is a 24, therefore uh, 5 minus 24, therefore here you will get minus 19. Okay, now the next is by the upper triangle for the upper triangle by R3 minus 7 times R2. Therefore, here you will get that is 1, 2, 1, 0, minus 1, minus 3. And here is again 0. R3 minus 7 times R2. And that will here it will become 0 minus 5 minus 7 and 3 that is a plus 21 minus 5 plus 21 minus 5 plus uh, 21 therefore you will get here this is the 16 minus 5 and plus 21 therefore here is a again the variable matrix x, y, z and the constant matrix. There is a 8 
minus 5. R3 minus 7 times R2. R3 minus 7 times R3. That is a minus 19 plus 35. Minus 19 plus 35. Then you will get the minus 19 plus 35. That is a 16. Okay. Now the matrix multiplication. That is a x plus 2y plus z. What about here? 0 minus y minus 3z. And what about the last? 0 plus 0 plus 16z. That is equal to. Eight minus five, and here is a sixteen. Okay. Now we'll substitute the values. Before that, by equality, equality of matrices. by equality of matrices. What is that? x plus 2y plus z is equals to 8. Minus y minus 3z minus 3z is equals to minus 5. And what about the last? 16z 16z is equal to 16. These are the equations. This is the first equation. Second. And the third. Now 16z is equal to 16. Therefore, z is equal to y. Put z is equals to one in equation two. Therefore, you will get minus y minus y minus three z is equals to minus five minus y minus 3 into 1 is equals to minus 5 and here minus 1 minus 3 that is equals to minus 5 minus 1 is equals to minus 5 plus 3 and that is equals to minus 2 minus 1 is equals to minus 2 and here is a minus 5 is equal to minus 2. Therefore, y is equal to 2. Now, put the value of y is equal to 2, z is equal to 1 in equation 1. Put y is equal to 2, z is equal to 1 in Equation 1. Now, what is the equation 1? That is x plus 2y plus z is equal to 8. x plus 2y plus z is equal to 8. That is x. 2 into 2 plus 1. That is equal to 8. Therefore, x. 2 into 2, 4. 4 plus 1, here is a 5. That is equal to 8. And therefore, x is equal to 8 minus 5. And that is equal to 3. Therefore, the value of x is equal to 3. Therefore, there is a x is equal to 3. y is equal to 2. And 
z is equals to 1 is the required solution. Okay. This question is a modified again. Now the next question. Now the next now here is a last problem x plus 3y plus 2z is equals to 6 3x minus 2y plus 5z is equals to 5 2x minus 3y plus 6z is equals to 7 the solution the given equations can be written in the matrix form as 1 3 2 3 minus 2 5 here is a and the next is a 2 minus 3 and 6 xyz and the these are the constant 6, 5, 7. Now the first operation is a, that is a R2 minus 3 times R1 where well, this 3 has a 0. Keep this first row as it is 1, 3, 2 and then you get 0, minus 11, minus 1. What about the next operation? R3 minus 2 times R1. Then here you get 0, minus 9 and the 2. X, Y, Z. This is a variable matrix 6, minus 13, minus 5. What about the next operation? That is the by by the operation R three plus two times R two. Therefore, one three two zero minus eleven minus 1 here is again 0 r3 minus 2 times 11 that is a minus 22 minus 9 that is here is a minus 31 and last here is a 0 and you will have the here is a x y z okay and that's equals to 6 minus 30. R3 plus 2 times R2. R3 plus 2 times R2. R2. That is minus 5 minus 26. Then you will have here minus 31. Now there multiplication. Here is a. You see this here the first two, first column you will have the equations x plus 3y plus 2z is equals to 6 second is minus 11y minus z is equals to minus 13 and what about the last that is a minus 31y is equals to minus 31. Now from the last equation that is a as a minus 31y is equals to minus 31. Therefore here y is equals to 1. This is the first part. Now put this value y is equals to 1 in this equation. Therefore, minus 11 y minus z is equals to minus 13. Therefore, minus 11 into 1 minus z is equals to minus 13. And here is a minus z is equals to minus 13 plus 11 that is equals to minus 2 and therefore z is equals to 2. What about the last equation? x plus the last equation is a x plus 3y plus 2z is equals to 6. x plus 3y plus 2z is equals to 6. The value of y is 1, z is 2. 
therefore here x plus 3 into 1 plus 2 into 2 and that's equals to 6 and therefore here is a x plus 3 plus 4 and that's equals to 6 therefore x is equals to 6 minus 7 that is equals to minus 1 therefore x is equals to minus 1 therefore hence x is equals to minus 1 this is the first value y is equals to 1 y is equals to 1 and z is equals to 2 is the required required solution and in this way we have completed this question that is a solve the equation by using the reduction uh, method now we'll see in the next video this is by using the this is the question by using the reduction method we'll now see in the next video till then goodbye